Once each eye is refracted, and assuming corrected visual acuity is essentially the same in the two eyes, many refractionists perform binocular balancing. This is to be sure that the level of accommodation is balanced between the two eyes, which may not have been the case during the monocular refractions. One method of binocular balancing uses the six prism diopter base up prism before the right eye to dissociate the two eyes. Some practitioners feel that this is too much prism and prefer to use two prism diopters of vertical prism before each eye for a total of four prism diopters of vertical separation. A 2040 line of letters is presented with the patient seeing two lines of letters, one above the other. The right eye sees the lower line. Both eyes are fogged and the patient is asked if both lines of letters are equally blurred. If the patient reports the lower line to be clearer, more plus power is dialed in before the right eye until the lines are equally blurred. The six prism diopter prism is then removed. The smaller lines are shown binocularly and sphere is changed binocularly in the minus direction until best vision is reached. Once binocular balancing has been completed, the patient should be perfectly focused at the distance of your visual acuity chart. If your chart is at four meters, you can dial one click up on both sides to move the patient's far points from four meters to infinity. I do this for hyperopes who are used to seeing absolutely clearly in the distance, but I usually leave myopes focused at the end of the room. If your visual acuity chart is at 20 feet or six meters, dialing a quarter diopter up on the foropter will place the patient's far point only a twelfth diopter beyond infinity.